here we are at the 2021 Emirates Airline Festival of Literature. Three beautiful outdoor venues. We've changed everyone's story. We've changed writers' stories, we've changed readers' stories, we've changed everyone's story because uh, we have managed to bring people together after nearly a year of isolation to have these conversations safely, socially distanced, but exciting agreements, disagreements, conversations that matter. هي تجربة جدا جدا فريدة من نوعها تجربة عظيمة مهرجان طيران الإمارات الآداب هو مهرجان ضخم ويحتفل بحب القلم حب القراءة وحب الكتب. It's really wonderful to see people out, people being very safe, but at the same time um, able to enjoy literature and able to get solace from books. In the Mahrajan, موفق للغاية يختار موضوعاته بعناية جدا. مهرجان طيران الإمارات للآداب فكهة الثقافة العربية. I feel very safe. I think they've done an amazing job. Uh, everything is outside. It's social distance. Everybody is wearing a mask. Uh, I think they have communicated it really well, uh, and also offering um, some people to be able to see it online. So I think I have definitely felt very safe. Uh, it was also the first time that I shared the stage with somebody who was uh, there by a screen, but it worked really beautifully. المهرجان خاصة في وقت الوباء وقت كورونا في هذه المرحلة له دور كبير في إعادة الثقة في في المجتمع في في بين الناس بشكل عام أنا برأيي أن مهرجان الإمارات للآداب يقوم بدور كبير جدا في توعية الأجيال الناشئة في تحبيبهم إلى فعل القراءة المهرجانات الثقافية والأدبية لا شك أن لها دور كبير في يعني جذب ال الجمهور المختلف مراحله العمريه وفئاته الى حاله الادب بشكل عام الى اشكال الادب الى الالتقاء برموز الادب والفن احيانا It's been amazing just the opportunity to reach more people and talk to more people and, and you know help them uh, is deeply satisfying for me so it's been a really rewarding experience ويعبر عن البيئه والمحافظه على البيئه وعن ال ال حتى التراث مالنا شيء جميل بصراحة ومش كورينا. We are going through a pandemic, but we are still able to enjoy literature as much as we ever were. So it's so important to be able to experience literature, to discover new writers, uh, to experience poetry, and so it's been a really uh, a really impactful thing. I think the the festival. It's very inspiring to be honest. It's really inspiring, and so obviously I say I've been watching this prize for a long time, this festival. I loved everything. I've loved, read a lot of the winners from previous times. They were incredible. It's really an honor to, <laughs> to be in that kind of company. It's very important to have a platform that gives us this kind of support and guidance and allows us to put our work out, out there and shows us that kind of appreciation. So it's definitely something I don't take for granted and I'm very, very happy that I was granted this opportunity at, at the Lit Festival. <laughs> What we've shown this year is that it is possible. Um, we look at arts and culture as a basic human right, and we were determined no matter what to keep on going, and I'm so glad that we actually did. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you to everybody who showed up physically or watched virtually from home. Thank you to authors who showed up on stage or on screen. Thank you for everyone who volunteered and our amazing team who put it all together and we're ready to change the story at any given time.